Hi and welcome to Momentum Basketball. My name is Frederick. Today I am going to uh, use some clips of Marcus Eriksson, a shooter playing in Alba Berlin. And I want to use that to um, show off some of the uh, myths that I'm talking about in other videos about shooting mechanics and, and show some things about which I talk about which I think is important for shooting mechanics. So, we're going to start off with a simple clip where uh, Marcus catches the ball off the handle and goes up for a one bounce, uh, pick one bounce and then up into a shot. What I want to emphasize here is basically that Marcus uses a very long and active strike stop, which I've spoken about in other videos, to get away from the defender and at the same time create a lot of energy into the floor, down into the floor, which can be utilized up and Marcus, as you can see, and I will show it soon again, do it in one motion before he reaches the peak of his shot. The so long and active strides though. <clears throat> Here we see it again. We can also see, which I will talk about more soon, that Marcus lifts the ball with a lot of body space. I've spoken about this also in other videos. From this angle, the same shot, I want to emphasize how Marcus lifts the ball uh, and how Marcus does not have a stiff elbow pointing straight at the basket, something that I think a lot of coaches still teach in the gyms. I think this is a overemphasized uh, part of shooting mechanics. I think it's not very important how you hold the ball, uh, how you lift the ball in that aspect and definitely not if you should have the elbow straight towards the basket. Marcus has a smooth motion going up, his elbow points out, it's very uh, easy to see. And also in this clip you can see that Marcus starts his shooting release before the peak of his shot. He's going up, his feet are basically still in the floor and the ball is starting to move towards the basket. Which is very clear here, the feet are just lift off the the floor and he's almost released the ball. You can also see on the same uh, aspect and, and topic of one motion shooting that he's on his way up still with his body when the ball is traveling towards the back. Here from this angle I want to emphasize body space. You can see Marcus dips slightly, brings the ball out into a banana motion basically which creates sort of a slingshot motion for him going uh, out and up and back towards the uh, forehead the, at the same time as his hip dips to create some energy and this is the final uh, shot I want to talk about not bending the knees something that is wrongly taught in gyms bend your knees, bend your knees like one is supposed to do it before catching the ball Marcus is straight. He has a proud posture when he catches the ball. Then he uses lights the energy when he comes into the floor to bring that up again. That's why he bends his knees after the catch. That was Marcus Eriksson uh, disturbing some of the myths about shooting mechanics.